Good morning and welcome to your Daily Sparks. You know, many years ago, uh, soon to be President George Bush Sr. spoke at a prayer breakfast in the United States. He talked about his most recent trip to Russia for the funeral of Leonid Brezhnev, the Russian Premier at the time. Now, he described the funeral as being precise and stoic, as precise and stoic as the communist regime. No tears were seen, no emotions were displayed, with one exception. Mr. Bush told how Brezhnev's widow was the last person to witness the body before the, the coffin was closed. And for several seconds she stood at his side, then she reached down and performed the sign of the cross on her husband's chest. How interesting, in, in a godless society like communist Russia at the time, in the hour of her husband's death she didn't go to Lenin or to Marx or to Khrushchev. She turned in the hour of his, his death and her dealing with it, she turned to Jesus Christ, the carpenter from Nazareth who lived 2,000 years ago, who dared to claim, don't let your hearts be troubled, trust in the Lord, trust in me. And he who trusts in me shall never see death. How interesting that a communist government, not unlike what many of us are dealing with here in the Western society these days, under duress, when times get tough, they still turn to Jesus because he's still the way, the truth and the life. We'll see you tomorrow on Sparks.